Welcome back for part two of What's the Difference? In part one, we compared a butterfly and a moth. We also compared a frog and a toad. Now, let's compare a crocodile and an alligator and find out what's the difference. Let's look at them. Hmm. Are they the same? No. Are they similar? Yes, almost the same. But what's different? The color is different. This color is a little bit lighter. This color is a little bit darker. Hmm, what about their mouth. We have a special word which we'll learn in a minute. This one is longer. This one is shorter. Let's look more closely at these two animals. Crocodile. Wow! Look at his teeth. And we have, this is called the snout. Do you have a snout? No. You have a nose. Maybe you have a pet dog. Some dogs have a snout. This snout is very long. Look at his eyes. Almost looks like a cat eye. Let's read about the crocodile. Crocodiles have a narrow, pointed snout. The opposite of narrow is wide. So crocodiles have a narrow and pointed. It comes to a point. Maybe it's like this. Narrow and pointed. Their upper and lower teeth stick out of their jaws. This is our jaw. Do your teeth stick out? No. But here we can see the top teeth and the bottom teeth all along the snout there. Wow! Crocodiles are a light tan color. It's really difficult to tell what color this is. There's many colors. Maybe some green, some tan. Wow, look at these eyes. These eyes pop out. Let's read about the alligator. Alligators have a short, wide snout. Right here. Do you remember the snout of a crocodile? A crocodile had a long, pointed snout. Like this. But the alligator has a short, wide snout, like this. A little bit different in shape. Their bottom teeth fit into holes in their upper jaw. That means we can't see their bottom teeth. But a crocodile, you can. We only see their top teeth here. Alligators are grayish-black in color. So remember, just like the crocodile, they have many colors. So it's difficult to say it's red or green or black. So it's grayish-black. And here it's a little bit lighter in color. They have many different colors. So we can tell the difference between a crocodile and an alligator because of its snout, color, and teeth. But what's the same? Oh, what's the same? They both have eyes on top of their head, and they are both reptiles. So their eyes are on top, not on the side, not on the bottom. They're on the top of their head. And they're both reptiles. 
Do you do learn any other reptiles? How about a snake? Is a snake a reptile? Yes. How about a lizard? The Komodo dragon. Is that a reptile? Yes, it is. Let's learn some more. Ooh, here we have a cheetah and a leopard. They look similar. They are both cats. But are they the same? Hmm. No, they are not the same. Let's find out what's the difference. A cheetah. Wow, they have tear lines. It looks like the cheetah is crying. And the cheetah's coat has black spots. Here, the cheetah is chasing an animal. The cheetah wants to eat this animal. Let's read about the cheetah. Cheetahs have black lines from their eyes called tear lines. Right here. The cheetah's crying. They have solid black spots on their coat. Coat. Is the cheetah wearing a coat like you wear a coat? No. For animals, their coat is their fur. So here we can see black spots on the cheetah's fur or coat. And they hunt by day. When you're at school, a cheetah is hunting. When you are sleeping, the cheetah is sleeping. And they can run fast, very fast. The cheetah is the fastest animal on land. Did you know that? Let's look at the leopard. This is a leopard. Can you say leopard? Very good. One more time. Leopard. Let's read about the leopard. Leopards do not have tear lines. Remember, the cheetah looks like he is crying. But this leopard does not have tear lines. Leopards have black rings on their coat. Do you remember what the coat is for a leopard or a cheetah? It's their fur. So here, there are black rings. For a leopard, they have rings. But a cheetah, it's more like a dot, like that. We can see by their coat, the rings or dots on their coat to see how they are different. A leopard, they hunt by night. They hunt for food when you are sleeping. They are good climbers. A leopard can climb a tree very easily. What is special about the cheetah? A cheetah can run very fast. Let's find out what's the same. They both hunt and eat other animals. Do you hunt and eat other animals? Maybe you don't hunt. Hunt means to find and attack. The cheetah is hunting this baby gazelle. But you do eat animals. They are predators. That's what predator means. They hunt and eat other animals. Humans, we are predators, just like this cheetah. They are both big cats. Big cats is also tiger and lions. Those are also big cats. Let's look at two more. We have a monkey and an ape. What's the difference? Let's look at them more closely. 
they look similar. They have different colors. They are both in trees. They both have long arms. Let's read about the monkey. Monkeys are tree lovers. Monkeys love to be in the trees. They live, they swing, they eat in the trees. They run along branches on all fours. Run along means to move or to swing. They go from tree to tree to tree. Some monkeys swing by their long tail. Wow! Look at that tail. It goes all the way around the tree branch. Do you have a tail? I don't have a tail, but monkeys have tails. An ape. Hmm. What color is he? He is an orange color. Let's read about the ape. In trees, apes swing from branches by their strong arms. Does he have a tail? No. Apes do not have a tail at all. But they swing from branches, just like monkeys. But they do not have a tail. What's the same about monkeys and apes? Let's find out. What's the same between monkeys and apes? Let's read together. Both animals live in groups. Hmm, like a family. You live in a family. That is a group. I live in a family. That is a group. Hmm, what else is new? They are both primates. Do you know another primate? Humans, you and me. So we are similar to monkeys and apes. Wow. Well, that's the end of part two. I'll see you very shortly for part three. Goodbye.